How to do, everyone? Guess who got out of jail? <laughs> Woo, doggy. Get this lit up so I can see all you beautiful chatting with me. Thank you, Bob. Those are, those are beautiful. Those are, uh, uh, do you work? Eight out of the ten items were sh for the Jesse Witchman. I would don't have the medal, unfortunately, a mock up of that. Um, and there's a collector's box as well. Bob, how are you? It's good to see you. Also, um, want to do a couple birthday shout outs to uh, Michelle Johnston. Happy birthday to you. Look who got a jail. I used my get out of jail for free card, um, which <laughs> I've been waiting to use. And uh, so yeah, I got out. Thank you, Jimmy, for covering the show yesterday. Also, uh, Gidget Hudson, happy birthday to you from a couple days ago. I sing to you guys. Happy birthday to you. I'm sure there's copyrights, but uh, happy birthday, guys. I hope you had a wonderful birthday. Um, I hope everyone's having a really beautiful week. Weather here is nice and windy. Um, just beautiful all around. Let me clear this out so I can see all you wonderful people talking. As soon as I can get this thing to load. There we are. Hi, hey, everybody. Um, hi. Yes. I am back. Uh, I am out of jail. Thank you, uh, Jimmy Coffin, for... Helping out with the Cherry Bonds Bail Company that uh, helped get me out. So thank you very much. Uh, all right, guys, I got a ton of stuff for you. I just wanted to show off some of these really beautiful edition for the Jesse Witchman uh, Artists Exclusives, Celebration Exclusives. They go live on Friday at 9 a.m. This is the Damnation Game Sublime Hollow Foil. Damnation Virgin Art Hollow, uh, Virgin Art. Uh, there will be, uh, of course, uh, a limited amount of the remarks as well available. This is the Extinction Express Black Rose Hollow Foil. This looks sexy. This is beautiful. Let me, let me get a close of that. This just looks really stunning. I love how the roses in the background, the camera doesn't pick it up that well, but they're just so faint in the background and how it reflects. It's really beautiful. Really beautiful. I think everyone's going to go crazy for this stuff. Here's the uh, virgin art version of the Black Rose. Michael Oliver, welcome to the show. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at all you beautiful people. Ruben is here. Jay. Yay, Bob got his shots. Ha, ha, ha. Uh, here is the, I switch it up and throw myself off. This is Chaos Rules. This is the Hell Flare Hollow Foil Edition. I really love Hollow Foil. That's some pretty stuff. So I'm going to just go through these real quick. I have a ton of stuff for you guys today. Um, I figured since um, I missed out... Oh, this one's a stun. Since I missed out on Monday, well, I might as well double you guys up today. So I got so many great new stuff, old stuff. Just stuff coming out of my ears for you guys today. Almost 40 items, maybe over 40. But look at the Unholy Ruin Feral Hollow Foil Edition. This is stunning. This is a really, wow, look at how that reflects. These will all go live 9 a.m. this Friday for the um, Jesse Witchman Artist Celebration. Check it out, 9 a.m. It's going to be some amazing stuff. Uh, I've already seen Jesse. He's been teasing some of this stuff, but, um, man, it's, it's some stunning stuff. Uh, so real quick, guys, uh, thank you for all the concerns. Um, I am good. I am feeling amazing today because I get to spend time with you guys on my Wednesday. So thank you for joining me, everybody. Let me zoom out a little bit. And I'm going to start off with some of these classic stuff, some coffin era things. Can I zoom out? Can I zoom out? There we go. Whee! I zoomed out. Ah. Do a little tilting action so you can get my head. Whew! So let's start things off with some mega cards, mega chromium cards to be exact. And what I have for you guys today is a combo pack I created. This is uh, Lady Death Mega Chromium card number five. This is by Stephen Butler, and I have included the mini print along with it. 
So I got only one card, one print set out of all of these. Next up, Lady Death Mega Chromium card number six. Mega Chromium cards. Jay Taylor, welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, I know that that Pharaoh one, Bob. I totally agree with you. It is a really beautiful piece. Here you go, another classic one. This is card number eight by the Dark Man. Who is this? Justice? No, Dark One. Classic artist, man. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, I have one of these. I have a duplicate of, and that's it. Um, so I apologize. Um, again, these stuff are the founding stones of Coffin Comics. This is Mega Chromium card number 11, art by Joseph Michael Lindsner. Beautiful piece. Look at that beautiful skull in the background. I miss jumbo hollow foil cards. One thing that was neat about the uh, 90s collecting is there was just so much out there, so much cool stuff. People were getting really experimental. Oh, oh no! Someone hooked Jay Taylor up! Here we go, Lady Death Mega Chromium card number 12. It's a Lady Demon image. Bam! Kenneth Rhodes, thank you very much. It's good to see you, man. How was your weekend? Actually, better yet, is everyone's week going by quickly? Because um, I hope so, because I know we all look forward to the weekend. Um, I'm looking forward to, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do this weekend, but I know it's supposed to be nice out. Hopefully it's not like 100 degrees already, so I can just be out there and just enjoy the nice breezes we're having. This is uh, Mega Chromium card number 13. It's a purgatory image. Jim Ballant is the artist. Only got the one. Mega cards, mega cards. Da -da 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 -do, it's the mega cards. Uh, oh, this is probably one of the most dramatic images, and I, I forgot that David Mack did this for us back in the day, Chaos Era. This is Mega Chromium card number 22. Look at that piece. Look at that. That is a really beautiful piece. Um, David Mack has done some amazing stuff. Kabuki is a character he created pretty much around the same era that Lady Death came to being. You had people like she, uh, David Mack doing Kabuki. Um, you had people doing the She books. Um, I'm drawing a blank on the name right now. Um, yeah, so it was really cool because there was a lot of indie publishers just really cranking out wonderful books and really uh, putting themselves out there. Here we go. Mega card 25. This is the Evil Ernie Lady Death Fiend Club. Wow, look at that. Classic. Classic. For all you guys that were scooping up the stickers I had last week, here's a nice chromium card to go with it. All right, here's my one doubles. Lady Death Mega Chromium card number 26. And there she is, a beautiful piece with Mr. Evil Ernie. I got two of these available right now. Oh, this is another real good one from uh, Jim Ballant, and it's got uh, Brian, Stephen Hughes, and uh, Jensen. This is uh, Mega Card number 29. <laughs> That's hilarious. Jay Taylor. How you doing, Jay Taylor? Oh, Eric, how are you? So good for star. I got some great news. What? Wait, what? No way, dude! Really? Oh, no way, Eric! That I can, that's both a blessing and a curse. Oh, dude! Oh! Oh, dude, I'm so sorry to see that. I'm like happy and sad at the same time. I'm conflicted. Oh, dude, dude. Man, you're going to Australia? It's freaking awesome. Mega card 32, up for you. Woohoo! Only got one of this. Mega cards were a lot of fun to find. I hope I can find some more, but it looks like um, they are completely gone. All right, next up. Mega card number 33. Boom. Really 
God, I love chromium cars. Who out there has uh, tons of co uh, comic cards, um, Chaos, Marvel, DC, whatever it is that you still have from the 90s? Let's get it sworn out there for all you folks that got these. Now, this was cool. I really thought these were uh, neat cards. This is the Lady Death Empress card set. Image is done by Joseph Michael Linsner. It's a three card set that formed the full image. Beautiful, beautiful. We got one set, one set. <laughs> All right, Matthew Davis knows what I'm talking about. I got some too, brother. I got some too. All right, next up, I found another promo card. This is super promo card for Lady Death Series 2. This is the Capital Super Promo. Art by the late, great Stephen Hughes. I only have the one. Uno mas, one promo card. Matthew Davis, thank you, man. Um, I'm having a wonderful day. I'm having a wonderful day, and I hope everyone out there is having one, too. All right, next up. This is a Catacombs find. I found six of these. This is Lady Death Pinups, Michael Turner, Hollow Foil Edition. I was blown away when I found these just sitting in a box, waiting for me to discover. There is six available. Once they're gone, I think that's it. I could be wrong, though. Next up, got a classic publisher file. This is a virgin art. Scully Pop. <sighs> hey, Matthew, uh, how's, uh, how's the weather and everything in your part of the world? Let us know, let us know. All right, time for some BP. This is Lady Death Gallery Yo-Yo Commission. Rumas one. Love these yo-yo covers. Hoping I can get some more in there. <laughs> Everything in Australia will kill you. <laughs> All right. After that BP, I got a number three, and this is going way back. Uh, I think 05, 06. It's a number three edition. This is Lady Death Apocalypse One, and I have a sketch and signature plate. And I have included the number three edition, COA. I only have the one, I was shocked. Didn't think I would have any more surprises, but all I've heard is, yes, so I've heard, yes. 75 and sunny, Oh, I was hoping to make some medals today, but the wind is blowing so much, I'll probably uh, you know end up having plates fly in my face. And, oh! Painful, I'm telling you. All right, found three of these. These are scratch and dent. They are publisher files. This is Lady Death Dragon Wars Peak to Boost Slammed Editions. I got three for you today. No, this looks. I don't know what this commission edition was. Um, with the yo-yo. That's. I've seen that posed before, but I don't think it's an homage. I think it would say homage, but um, no, I think it's just a, a commission piece she did for someone. All right, I got two more publisher files, Scratch and Dance. This is the Blood Moon Slabbed Edition. I got two for you. Such a stunning piece, such a stunning piece. Oh, dude, talk, Eric. Dude, that's, that's some, uh, wow. That is a tough choice, man. Wow, what a predicament, dude. Oh, my gosh. Well, here's, if you do go, I hope we can all meet up soon, you know. I really do. I really do. I'm already, uh, looks like I'm going to be having coffee with Jay Taylor uh, here at Workfest. Looking forward to that. Next up, Damnation Game Mega Incentive Scratch and Dent. I got about three of these available for you today. Bam. Ooh, I'm gonna fill up this whole thing. Wait, there's more, <laughs> lots more. I have uploaded the first 10 chapters of Lady Death, Coffin Verse, 
These are premier editions. They are scratch and dent. So chaos rules through um, Blast Me Anthem. Had to think there for a second. Really great, great way to hand out your copies without getting them damaged. There's some scratch and dents now available for you. If they go out on the, on the uh, store, check the eBay store. I do have stock there as well. So double places to look. All right, got some more scratch and dent. This is Scorch Earth number one, premium foil edition. I got four copies right now. That is probably one of the most beautiful uh, premium foils we've done for the direct market. I absolutely love it. All right, what other surprises? Hopefully. You know what? You know what? I, I've got so much stuff. Let me go on to this. I found three resolute prints. These are the embossed ones. There is three left. So I put up the last three here in the catacombs for you today, guys. If you missed out the four, uh, now's your chance. These are my last three. Also, doing some more digging around. Oh, I found I, I, I found some cool stuff. Let me move these mock-ups so they don't get hurt. Back here. Yeah, I got I got some prints to show you guys. I got some prints in the new power generation. <laughs> Uh, if anyone gets that reference, you're old like me. All right, here we go. Yeah, I got to be working on um, getting um, one of the things written up. So I'll be talking to Nick today, see what we can do for you there. I have a metallic print. Bam, Raider Heart. Digging around and then in another box. Beautiful. This is a metal print. I have one metal print. I also have right here, Evil Ernie Necro Print Series 1. And this is signed by the artist, uh, Jerry Beck. So you guys want some classic... Oh, Jay, yeah, you got that reference. Thank you. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, so I got a couple of those. Next up, this is Evil Ernie. Necroprint Series 2, also signed by Jerry Beck. And it's weird because he signed it way over there. And these are from, uh, looks like 04? 01. 01. Okay. These things are 20 years old. Got a few of these available. Let me see. I got one, two, three, four of the Series 2 one. All right. Here we go. Hi, Karen. All right, here we go, here we go. <laughs> Thank you, Jay, for knowing that reference. <laughs> Next up, Purgatory, Necro Print Series 2. This is signed by Romano Molinar. I hope I'm saying that right. Purgatory, beautiful print. These are beautiful. And if you want it, you can even color them if you want. I've seen some people do amazing stuff with black and white prints. Series backwards? Did I? Series two. Series two. Necro Evil Ernie. Series one. Evil Ernie. I'm confused. Hey, everybody! Carmen's in the house. Hi, Carmen. Next up, Necro Print Series two. Lady Death signed by Ivan Rez. I have two of these. Website has it out. <laughs> Uh, okay, uh, thank you for the heads up. I will let them know uh, on the prints. Yes, Necro prints are black and white. Um, it looks like they all came out in 2001. So these prints are 20 years old. Uh, they all have serial numbers. 100 were produced, so uh, these are the few I can find. Uh, they are um, serial numbered, so there is serial numbers on these as well, uh, Eric. Website has it backwards. Okay. Uh, thank you. I will let them know. So when we pull up the orders, I will... That. All right. Another beautiful print for you. It's a metal print. She took a licking 
in her package, but this is a scratch and dent. This is from uh, Nightmare Symphony, and it is signed by Brian. Bam. This is it. You know, it's funny. I, 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 I've only seen maybe three metal prints the whole time I've been here in two years, and um, I think they look beautiful. Um, hopefully, we'll make some more down the road. Hey, Jay, if I want to cross another one, I will message you. I still got, I have boxes of prints, like five, six boxes of just prints. Um, a lot of her stuff I've been making the um, uh, grab bags for that I have on eBay where it's five prints for 25. Some duplications will happen. Uh, I try to make it so, you know, they're spread out. Um, but I do have some boxes of other older prints, and if I run across one, Series 2 Evil Ernie, uh, I'll let you know, Jay. Uh, I'll give you a heads up. Uh, I hope I answered your questions, Eric, on what a necro print was. Um, these were near the end of the chaos area. Really cool stuff. Really cool stuff. All right, let's get back to some more beautiful books I got for you guys. How about some skirt shirt? Skirt shirt. Scorched Earth, number two, Naughty Edition. This is the comic shop market. Beautiful piece. Beautiful piece. Whoo! And it's warm in this room today. I forgot to turn on the AC. But then again, if that, that AC turns on, it's like really loud. So uh, I apologize if it's a little hard to hear me. Uh, so I will project my voice as my choir teacher said. Project it out forward using my diaphragm to push out that extra breath so I can get up some octaves higher. Boy, she'd be proud of me if she was still alive and heard me say all that. Thank you, Mrs. Nelson. <laughs> Next up, Lady Death, Bless Me Anthem, number one naughty edition. I have one signed and two unsigned. But of course, if you want them signed, that's quite all right. Just say, I want my stuff signed. We'll lay everything out. Brian will be right there. Chickity chat, chickity chat. Signing away, signing away. All right, next up. Oh, beautiful premium foil. This is Blasting Anthem number two, premium foil edition. Boom. Look at that piece. It's beautiful. Oh, wow. Look at that shine right on those buckles, man. That is beautiful. And I love the skull that's hidden in the foil right up in here. It's part of her signature. Just. Beautiful. Wow. That thing really pops when the right light hits it. Bam. Shazam, I say. Shazam. Sorry. Kicked in my diaphragm a little too high right there. Bingo was his name, though. All right. Next up, I got some Zodiac editions. I have four Scratch and Dent. This is Lady Death, the Zodiac. This is the Incentive Edition. Carmen, how are you today, by the way? I, I, I apologize for not uh, greeting you as you uh, popped up. My, uh, my apologies. That was very rude of me. All right, here we go. Oh, let me check the time. Oh, okay, we got some time. Yay. This is Lady Dent, Naughty Zodiac. I got three Scratch and Dent copies. Bam. Look at the beauty. And the interior of these, these guys, this is a really... Neat um, addition. You have beautiful art on the one side and the text about the uh, zodiac sign on the other. Really beautiful art. Um, oh, I forgot the artist's name. Uh, Niai, I, I know I'm going to say this wrong. Niai Rofino. I hope I'm saying that right. Man, I'd love to see uh, new zodiac editions. What do you guys think? Uh, I, I think um, it's about time. Uh, I would like to see something kind of similar to like, hey, uh, Zodiac Edition for a whole year, we did have feature one artist that uh, does each month in this, you know, Zodiac. I, I think that would be a pretty neat idea. Um, so yeah, let me guys, if you guys want to shout out a Sworn, maybe I can see if we can't do that. Woo, man, I totally look like I, I need to, Wow, I totally look like I was in jail. <laughs> oh, Carmen. 
You have some of those metal zodiac cards. That imagery is inside those books, some of that imagery. Beautiful, beautiful interiors. Dude, uh, that's actually something I, I had said over a year ago to Brian, like um, a rock, a, like pop, iconic uh, album covers or something like that. So yeah, great idea. Yeah, Addy, thank you. Thank you. You know, I, I, I'd like to see that too. I think it'd be a neat idea and, uh, you know, I, I think it's something that we can constantly use. I mean, it's a circulating artists each year doing different Zodiac covers. I, I think it's a beautiful idea. So thank you, Abby. Thank you for your comment. I appreciate it. Um, Carmen, I, I hope you really, uh, I know you have a lot of the metallic cards. So um, definitely, definitely you'll want that Zodiac uh, book. It's beautiful interiors, covers just as beautiful, and the write-up on the um, Zodiacs, of course, is really nice. Really nicely produced book. Okay, real quick. Uh, what else? Okay, a few more minutes. Woohoo! All right, it's, it's hot in here. There you go. There you go. There's my, my sexy dance. Wow, you guys are coming up some great... I Ooh. Oh. Jay Taylor. That, sound, that sounds cool. And you guys are really coming up with some great ideas. I love this. I, I, this is why I love the group. Um, just throwing out fun ideas on additions we'd like to see in the future. And just, it's great to see you guys have it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Carmen. Also, guys, uh, there'll be a big bolt sale coming up next month. So, there you go. There's your warning. Uh, all right, I'm just about out of time. Uh, real quick, guys, uh, thank you very much. Um, thank you, Jimmy, for uh, hosting the show for me on Monday. Um, <laughs> um, I'm glad I, uh, I, I, I didn't get um, in too much trouble, you know, but when you're spray painting justice for Jeff along the freeway, well, you're going to get caught. And, well, I, I got caught, but just remember, justice for Jeff. <laughs> that one's for you, Miguel. All right, guys. Does CC take the... Um, I don't think so, um, but I like to throw out weird ideas on additions, um, to Brian, um, because we have so much, uh, you know, new art and classic art, and Brian's just got so much beautiful stuff that, you know, he's just putting it out, uh, here and there, and, um, it's great to see what he's bringing out. Um, he just gave me a nice little stack of stuff. Some pretty cool classic stuff from almost 20 years ago, including some really cool chaos item that I will be putting up on future catacombs probably three weeks from now. Um, I squealed like a little girl when he showed it to me. I'm just telling you, it was like, wow, that sounded inappropriate. I apologize. <laughs> but no, I, I let out a squeal with the uh, merchandise uh, he gave me last night. So. I'm really looking forward to you guys' reaction to it when I upload it on future ca uh, catacombs. Wow. Wow. You know what, guys? I'm really loving all the love you guys are giving to Yo-Yo. Uh, I met her. Uh, the first time I ever saw her art was at Fiend Fest uh, two years ago. I was blown away. I was really just blown away by her style, and I'm really glad that Everyone has just really been embracing her, along with all of our artists. And uh, thank you all who have been bought the original art editions in the past. I am completely out at the moment. Um, I don't think I have any left anywhere. Um, but I really appreciate it, and I know Coffin Comics really appreciates it. You seek out our cover artists to do those original arts. Um, so thank you very much, guys. That, that means a lot to a publisher when folks are using their own art, uh, our own artists to get original art done. So. Thank you really from the bottom of our hearts. Ask is there can be a print of the first witch in the Oh that's a new one. Uh, I think there is. Uh, no, no, that's for the um, the K 
Chaos Rules cover. Ah! Hmm. Wow, you guys are just putting out some great idea. More friends. All right, you guys. I'm so glad to be back, guys. Thank you very much. Remember, justice for Jeff, Brandy Sparkles. And I just want to say, I'm Julian the Hooligan. I'm sorry to you. It's wonderful to be back. It's wonderful to see all you guys here. And um, thank you, guys. Um, I will talk to you Monday with some more stuff, classics and new. I'll talk to y'all later. Stay sworn, everybody. And just think, Swarm Fest is right around the corner. Asta.